My guy, man, Don Chief's in the building. Big Chief. A.K.A. Big Chief. <laughs> A.K.A. Yeah. Big Chief is yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, Don Chief, man. What it do, guy? What it do, my man, guy? I'm man, I'm just... Appreciate you. Appreciate thanking you, you for, for coming, me. man. Nah, nah, I appreciate you for steady rolling it out, how you roll it out for me. You know what I'm saying? I fuck with those who fuck with me. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. It, man, hey man, we back at the hub, man. We back, hey Dallas, Texas, man. Stand up, man. Hey man, listen, man. We got a guy here today, y'all. He really don't need no introduction, man. Really to be don't. real with you, man, this guy right here, man. When I didn't have, you know, I started out, man, calling certain dudes, man. And when I called this dude, it wasn't no hesitation for him to come over here. And this nigga don't, hey, he, he a real one. I called him after that. He a, been hustling in the city. Every time I called him, he picked the phone up, man. This my guy, man. Done Chiefs in the building. Big Chief. A.K.A. Big Chief. <laughs> A.K.A. Yeah. Big Chief is yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, Don Chief, man. What it do, guy? What it do, my man, guy? Man, I'm man, just... I appreciate you. Appreciate thanking you, you for, for coming, me. man. Nah, nah, I appreciate you for steady rolling it out, how you roll it out for me. You know what I'm saying? I fuck with those who fuck with me. Simple. Real. So... You showed me you were fucking with me, so I just returned the favor. Like that's man, just how I rock. I said a hundred thousand times, man. When I called you, when I called Lil Runny, when I called Duro, see, cause I know already the ones in the city for me that really, you know, when I would go, like I said, when I go to Capital Bum, or if I'm talking to Diamond D, or if I'm talking to George, cause I'm a real nigga that been here with yeah. these niggas, man. Gotcha. And gotcha. I know who they told me was the ones. You see what I'm saying? And I and I heard the music. So I never disrespect that for sure, man. Like coming into this city, I've been here longer than most of these niggas rapping. You know what I'm saying? I've been in this city for 30 some years. For sure. So for sure, I, for sure. I really, really try to bring everybody together. I tried that starting out, didn't I? It didn't work out right now. <laughs> I mean, once again, that's why you just gotta mess with those who mess with you. I you know. know. You can't mm-hmm. force it. You know what yeah. I mean? You know, just it gotta be by choice, not by force. Yeah, um, like, yeah. Like simply, just like how you saying that, you know, when you called me and reached out, I, I, you know, I reacted the way you wanted to. Yeah. You know, you go have the ones that you got, you could talk to, talk about like that, but you go also have the ones that, you know. Uh, head a whole opposite direction. <laughs> yeah. You <laughs> yeah. head a whole, do a whole yeah. 360 and go the other way, quick. Good show. Good show. You Good know, show. and I had to learn that, you know, even in this business, you know, hiring different people, understand, you, you'll be able to relate to this, certain people, Certain, and me and my wife went through this for years. This store been in 15 years. We had to learn to start to let people come in and out of our lives, brother. Right. It, right. It, the girls we would hire, the dudes we would hire, it was hurtful at first because it was like, damn, you know, you, you, you draw this, damn, why this happened? But you learn over the years in business that you got to watch people walk out that door and never worry about them coming back again. Mm-hmm. Uh, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> now, that ain't just business. That's life. That's life. Yeah, that's life. Yeah, ain't nothing gonna last forever. Yeah, yeah. I mean, just truth be told, ain't nothing gonna last forever, even if it's a good thing. Yeah, yeah. I get it, man. You know, uh, if it's a good thing, it hurts more. Yeah. <laughs> That's all. It's levels to you success, know? bro. Yeah. Huh? It's levels to success. Whoa. Hey, so, you know, uh, Money Moses, man. Uh, man, you know, I, I know you weren't here last time that I interviewed Don Chief. Nah. And how long Whoa. that was, man? Because I can't even remember. That was. Man. Almost a year ago. Well, I wasn't here. We only been doing this a year and a half. I you was, came quick. Okay, I okay, was here. okay. You was here the day he came? Yeah, I just ain't talked to him, but I was here. Oh, you was here? Yeah. I know you always around. I couldn't, I know my wife was the one yeah, that did here. the interviewing, but you was here. Yeah, I was here. I don't, do you remember? I didn't remember. I don't remember. I don't, nah. I, See what I'm saying? Nah. I, that day, I ain't going to lie, that day you came in I don't the think same. I stayed. Oh, you didn't stay? I don't think I stayed that day. I, I know I was here. Photo Homie was here that day. Certain oh, niggas was here that I know because yeah. he was doing my behind the scene. Gotcha. Just gotcha. like he here today. Gotcha. I'm going to know who's doing my, my, my behind the scene because that's how I like I do my pictures. Like you'll see, he's going to yeah, do some pictures, send them to you. You're going to see. Okay. You know, it's going to look live. That's gotcha. the way I'll be I thinking. Want, and he better than, uh, I ain't going to say he better than Photo Homie because Photo Homie love doing visuals. You know, you're a video guy. Really. This guy really rocked them pictures. They got their own lane. Yeah, they both do, it, do their own thing, yeah. man. So let me ask you this, man, because last time, you know, uh, when you came on here, you had, a, I think, the shoes, the thing that were going with the shoes. How did that go and what ended up happening with it? Uh, they still in, in motion. It's just pretty much me just putting more love into it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, honestly, I got a great big gumbo of things going, and I just ain't gave one thing 100%. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm just, uh, I'm just pretty much 
putting everything in the pot. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. It's stirring it up. You know, it's stirring everything there. You know what I mean? I seen, you know, you just the type of dude that you just stay busy. You know what I'm saying? When it come down to your music, man. When is the, like, like the last time you had some videos, I was some little niggas in the south side. I think that's where they was at. I keep it gangsta and I keep it groovy. Breaking my map, now these hoes want to do me. I don't love a dog, she just a floozy. And y'all did a video, remember, because I clipped it and I, you know, I'm saucing it up on my, on yeah, my, yeah, when yeah. I put the interview out, I'm like, uh, yeah, I'm going to throw this right yeah, there and yeah, put this yeah, right there. Yeah, a little strap and deuce. Yeah, yeah how yeah. they doing? Man, I, I see them still working and okay. boys still, you know, it seems like they still in their lane, they riding it, you know, everybody still, you know, pushing. Yeah, I mean, pushing. I see them pushing. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.